how much that's going to hurt and how many bones will just snap because they're probably all just made of powder now anyway. The only guarantee that I always say, if you don't, if you want to guarantee not falling off, don't get on. You all right getting straight on him? Yeah. Yeah? Well, what would be the alternative? Not to Well, there isn't really, no. so... <laughs> <laughs> when I said that, I just thought to myself, if you said, well, actually, I'm not, although we'll do our imaginary ride. All right, I'm uh, on the horse. Look. What do I do I'll now? Do the now I'll do the click clock. Heels right down. Right. <laughs> you know? All right. So, good boy. Good boy. Good boy. The lesson begins, and I'm keen to show Tim that when it comes to horses, I do at least know how to get on one. <laughs> Oops! <laughs> Hang on a minute. It's my first jumping lesson since I was 15, and it's fair to say I may well have acquired some bad riding habits in all that time. People talk about having a good seat when they're riding. They think yeah. it's in the bottom. No, no, no. A seat the is from here to the there. So what we want is that posture. You're balanced. You're giving and taking with your hands and your shoulders are nicely open to go round turns. OK, cool. Yeah. Getting it. And we're going to go straight from walk to canter. Sorry, oh. I forgot to mention that. OK. I've never done that. Oh, well, you're going to do that now, because that's good for competitions. When we're ready, and in a little inside rain, and canter. Go on. Go on. That's it. That's good. Good girl. Very good. Really good. And walk. Good. OK. Just one little point here. I want that lower leg just slightly to come there. OK. Because what's happening is you're just, just nipping there. him a little bit. OK. So, what, if you like, you're putting an accelerator and brake. Ah. And he's going, what, Got what, it. what, what, what? So, by just doing that, that. body back in there, he'll, yeah. he'll feel it. Oh, she's slowing down. So cool. much better. OK. Before long, Tim prepares some jumps, providing yet more flashbacks to my youth. I was always nervous of jumping heights as a child. I think because I always thought the horse would stop and I would get flying off, which often happened. Yeah. Remember, for a jump, you gently raise out the seat. Yeah. Because you can't possibly sit to a jump. If you do, you get bounced up. Steady him a little bit. OK, go with him. One, two, three, four, five. Good girl, good girl. It's a little sticky with regard to the first one. Keep coming, you've got one. Go with him, go with him. Go with him. Good girl, good girl, well done. <laughs> first one wasn't as good as it could have been. Tim is a great teacher and is constantly reinforcing this idea of rhythm and the counting of the strides between the fences. You've got one, it's a beauty. And four strides. One, two, three, four. Lovely, 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 lovely. Your horse is ready your competition with must be that trained to go, you want me to jump? I'm going to jump that until you tell me not to. Yes, fantastic. Yeah? I love that. He's an extraordinary teacher because he clears your head of all that sort of endless instruction you had when you were a kid, do this, do that, kick him on. And he makes it so clear and so focused that you feel confident to do it. You know what's quite nice, I think, about riding a horse that you don't know is that you're not emotionally attached to it. It, it, was, it was like... Like driving a, fun, a different car, you know, it's sort of enjoyable just to try out the different things, but I was not emotionally attached to them. <laughs> I always maintain that, that the horse needs, he needs respect. He doesn't need love, he needs respect. Yeah. Uh, and I thought the way you rode them today, you, you, you rode them on that level. So when it comes to my half-baked idea of entering the Grassroots Championship, Tim delivers his verdict. My feeling would be that if you had the right horses, right help, your focus and you were able to get the riding in, mm. you, you've got a very good chance of doing it. But it's not going to be easy. Let's not no, kid ourselves. It's, 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 it's getting the it's work and the riding, the riding in. in. But ultimately, yeah. you do have that natural core time to be able to do it. And most importantly, whatever trepidation I had about jumping has been discarded forever. The sort of high you get just from doing a little course like that is, um, is rather nice. And I just love jumping. <laughs> I actually love jumping. <laughs> <laughs>